In this video, I'm sharing a list of five ultimate things there is to do in Dubai, and they're probably the coolest things I've ever done in this city since I moved here four years ago, so I'm so excited to share them with you. So guys, first off on the list was scuba diving in the last chambers in the Atlantis Pam. So in the next hour, we are going to be in here scuba diving in the sharks. So each of us got a qualified paddy diver to come down with us and just kind of guide us through the chambers and to help us with our breathing and also to just keep us calm, which I definitely needed. But it was so cool to see so many different colorful fish and to get up close and personal with these sharks, which was kind of scary, but also very, very cool. And then there's also a photographer that comes down with you and takes really cool pictures of you while you're scuba diving. So we have really nice memories from the day and it was just so much fun. So worth it, right? Oh my god, that was unreal! So we're just down here in Usakim with Nemo Water Sports and we are about to go flyboarding. So basically, I'd never even heard about flyboarding before I came to Dubai, but it's like you're on a hoverboard and water shoots you up into the air and you fly. How amazing! Oh, that's what I'm going to be doing. <laughs> Have the GoPro ready. Let's go! So probably not one of the easiest water sports ever to do but it is honestly just so much fun like once you get your balance and see how high you can actually go in the air it is just such a good challenge like you can see that i did a lot of nose dives a lot of awkward falls but it was just so much fun and we had just such a blast so next up it was zip lining across the marina on the world's longest urban zip line my heart is racing so fast. So you're actually going 80 kilometers an hour, which is really, really fast. So the experience actually goes quite quickly, but you have the most epic views of the marina and JBR. And then at the end, you also get your own personalized video of the whole experience. Amazing. I loved it. That first initial release. Yeah. Unbelievable. So number four on the list was our luxury desert safari trip with Platinum Heritage and it was so incredible from start to finish. Literally everything from the open top Land Rovers, which I absolutely loved, to our really funny tour guides called Ali and Rios. They were just brilliant. They were literally cracking jokes nonstop. They had us all in stitches, but they were also so informative. They told us all about life in the desert and how it was back in the Bedouin times as well. So next stop, we are going to get some day chips now and fun the Falcon Show. So during the Falcon Show, we also learned that Falcons are a symbol of force and courage here in the UAE and that they all actually hold their own passport, which I didn't know before. And a lot of the time they travel first class whenever they're traveling to different countries. Fortunately, I've never been next to a Falcon on an airplane before, but hopefully I will be yet. So we just arrived. Arabic coffee, the best coffee in the world. It's hot. <laughs> so strong, it's really good. A few shots of this every morning and you'd be sorted for the day. <laughs> you actually would be, it's so strong. <laughs> So some vegetable rice, some veggies, and a veggie kebab. 
So after eating our really delicious food, we got involved in some of the traditional Arabic dances and shows, which were really, really cool. And then for the rest of the night, we just chilled out smoking shisha, even though I wasn't very good at smoking it, but it was really good fun and we just had such a laugh. So last up, it was skydiving over the Pound Mira, and this was just the most incredible, exhilarating experience ever. This was something that I never thought I would do because I was scared of heights, but this year I wanted to do all these crazy, scary activities to just kind of push my boundaries, and it was just so worth it. So definitely anybody who is scared of heights, I think they should just go for it, fight the fear, and just do it because it's such an amazing memory to have. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video and found it valuable. I'm also really curious to find out what are your ultimate things to do in Dubai. So definitely comment below to add to this list. And if you do want to see more of this Dubai series, be sure to subscribe to the channel. And with that, I will see you in my very next video.